What's up guys? Dynamite Man DGI here and welcome back to more Let's Play Super Mario RPG. In the last episode we got the fifth star. And in this part, we are going to return it or give it to the elder in Seaside Town. So without further ado. Yeah, I found the star. Oh, I'm gullible, huh? You're, you're okay. Uh, okay, you're, you're rid of it. Oh, you're a member of Smithy's gang. Oh, uh, not really. You you, you kind of look kind of weird. Uh, yeah, it's an ordinary person. If you would call a toad an ordinary person. Okay, brownie points. Hey, uh, you're rid of it. You got something uh, uh, on your on your nose there. Okay. Um, yeah, let's let's hand it over. We don't want any trouble. I don't think I want any trouble anyway. I mean, this guy is obviously a member of Smithy's gang. He's obviously someone I don't want to mess with. Okay, this is... This is not good. This is not right. Anyway, um... Let's get a couple more, um... Flower points in there for good measure. And, um... This appears to be locked, so... Maybe we can find answers later. Of what's in there. Alright. Blade? The vampire hunter? No. Um. Uh, it wasn't really that far. I mean, I don't know how you would have gotten away, really. It kind of took my time, but anyway. Okay, so we're best friends with Johnny now for all of, uh, all of a sudden. I, I, I don't know. Take the skies off now. Okay, what I don't get is, like, how is it that Yaridovich is able to, like, become, like, multiple people? That's just weird. Anyway. I'm boss time! This is Yaridovich! And I'm going to open up with a Gino Boost on Mario! It'd be a good idea to do it on uh, Mallow there, but um, I honestly don't have the attack that I need for him. But it is kind of ideal to have Mallow in the party for this fight, mainly because um, he's bulky. And not just his shape. And he's going to use Water Blast, which is kind of dangerous for me, but um, hopefully I can live fighting him. And this is the part that I was kind of dreading about... Um, a low level run here is because this is the part of the game where it really bulks up on like how difficult it is. Actually, let's use um um okay, I'm gonna use a HP rain on Mallow here. Just because I'm kind of predicting that he's not gonna use a oh crap. Okay. Um Okay, that wasn't too bad for the other guys, but yeah, this is gonna this is gonna become kind of complicated here. Let's jump on him, and now let's um, bring back Gino. Nuts! So I've already wasted two turns fighting this guy. And that's gonna be like the bun cake fight now, isn't it? Let's just jump on him. Eventually he'll go down, hopefully, here, so... I mean, well, if you attack someone here, of course it's gonna... You're eventually gonna bring him down. You don't freaking hit someone and not expect to, anyone to go down because, you know, as a result of it. Anyway. Um, I don't think that made sense. Oh, nuts. Mirage attack. Now, he's gonna split himself off into two different, um... Two different clones, or he's gonna make a clone of himself, or whatever, and, um... So, which one do we hit? We hit the one that you target. I'm serious. Just hit the one that you target. He targets. You target. And that's the real one. Like, straight up. Okay, let's have Mallow at or Gino attack here. And we'll have Mallow attack. Oh, whoa! 
Okay. Super hammer. Okay, um, let's see here. Let's use an elixir here. I'm getting kind of skeptical about my ability to stay alive here. Okay, let's make measures, take measures into our own hands and use, just use a thunderbolt here because I'm getting annoyed. Okay, missed. Haha. Uh -huh. And let's use a jump. Eventually, this guy's got to go down sooner or later, so... Chip there we go. Got him back to normal, anyway. Let's use a super flame on him. I'm having some terrible luck with the timing on that lately. I don't know why. I don't know. I might be getting a little tired out here because I'm batch recording again. Oh, do, do not kill everyone. I've had a history of losing this fight just because it, yeah, he ends up killing everyone with that attack. But typically, he, um, that attack will tend to miss, um, uh, one of, one of your allies at a certain, you know, one time or another. He's got a high chance of it, I mean. I'm like shocked you're here. I missed the timing again. Alright, Willy Wisp isn't too bad. It's just gonna attack one one of my characters. I suppose he's trying to make up for missing Mario there. Alright. Dude, seriously. Like, go down. Oh! <laughs> okay. Obey my commands. I really like this, um this fight, fighting background there, too, with the, the setting sun in the background and everything. That's actually kind of cool. Alright, new music. Can we get the fifth star back? Alright, Smithy, Smithy uh, is now aware of the star pieces, so we're in trouble. But, um, ooh, there's a key. It's a shed key. And, um, there's a note here from Nonya... Knowing you must have been a breeze knocking out Yari Day. It's a huge axe lying across the sky, huh? So, um... Yeah, we're gonna have to keep an eye out that. So, yeah, we are got an in invitation to go and see Johnny whenever we want now, so that's pretty cool. Now, if we head down here... Use that shed key on the door here. And the townsfolk of this place are in here. Dirty old places like this. Hey, fella. All right. All right. Stop them. Um, yeah, these guys are all like, you know, townsfolk, and they, they own the shops and everything. And this must be the real Al Alder. Yes. Yep. And if you do if you do exactly what Yurdovich says, and you give the star on the first try, you get a flower box. And I do believe that the, um, the prizes for that, um, decreases as you continue to refuse. I'm gonna use that flower box now, because that gives us 70 flower points. Holy crap! Anyway. Um, you come in here. I do believe, um, we have a new we uh, weapon in here. Um, the Trooper Shell! And, uh, one thing that I would like to talk about concerning this, though, uh, as well. So, in here there are, um, replicas of the, um, other weapons that you have bought throughout the game, including the Kinkling shell, and, um, the handgun, which packs a kick, haha, <laughs> um, and as well as this hammer. Now, this hammer is actually different from the hammer that you got from the Hammer Brothers. This hammer is actually a lucky hammer. I think it nuts. I hate when my finger, like, does that. Oh, let's, let's do this. There we go. <laughs> and let's sell that hammer back. I, I don't want that hammer, just because it's... It's nothing, like... It's nothing important to me, but I'm gonna sell this and this. And this polka dress. 
and the chomp and, and the masher finally. And I'm going to buy the trooper shell, the trooper shell, a parasol, uh, the double punch, and the rivet stick. Don't need the hair of the gloves because we already got those in the last area. And we're finally like done using hammers for a while. We're back to using shells, which is kind of cool. And then um, the rivet stick is back. Double punch! That's going to be an interesting thing to show off later. It's one of my favorite weapons for Gino. I'm going to switch the parasol for Peach. And I do believe that's everything that we need from this guy. Head over here. And we're going to buy... Um, I don't think we need anything here. Hold on, let me check here. Um... I don't think this is something new. Let me see here. No, it's not. Okay, don't buy anything from this guy. <laughs> sell that. Okay, uh, and I'm going to sell the charm shell, the super hammer, the handgun, the bomb glove, and the slap glove. And I usually like to try and keep all my accessories, so yeah, you should too. And I do believe we have to here. Nope, we don't want to go in there. <laughs> this one? Yes, this one. Alright, so... I think she just sells everything that you kind of want to have in the, anyway. Um... I don't think we need anything from... Yeah, I think we're pretty much well-equipped now. We're actually ready to head to the next area as soon as we talk to, um... The Elder again. So I'm going to switch back uh, the Zoom Shoes back on to Mallow there. And I'm going to switch out, um... Switch, switch him out and get Peach back into the party. So, um... I'm going to put the safety ring back on her for now. Alright, so... I'm going to talk to the Elder here. Apparently you can't talk to him over the table, which is dumb. Alright, um... Um... So he's saying that there's a town that's located um, north of here. And uh, we have to take a place called... Uh, we have to go through a place called Lion's End. And I've thought about it long and hard what I wanted to buy and what I want to buy um, that would probably uh, benefit me a lot is the screw drink now I don't have enough frog coins right now to um, get this but I will soon and when I do I'll, I'll buy it and then when I get back uh, when I have a chance I'll come back here and I'll get the screw, the screw drink I think that'll be a nice um, powerful um, thing to have for one of my mages. Okay, now what I'm going to do here now is that I, I keep forgetting when this is, but if you go to Mobile after you take down Yaridovich, this guy will be here, and he has restocked his inventory. He found a mystery egg in the mines. He's selling it for 200 coins. And he bought, if you buy it, um, you can use this mystery egg for um, certain reasons, and I'll go over what those reasons are in the next video. Because it's kind of hard to explain, like without actually like getting into a battle. And I already got the um, the bathtub ring, so I, yeah, I think I got everything that I wanted to do out of the way here. And actually, let me check on something here real quick. Actually, I think I can do this here, but I'd have to, um... I'd have to sell something here. Hold on. Let me sell... I need just... I need 500 coins. Um... I don't really have anything to sell here. 
Oh well, I, I'll, I'll come up with the money off screen or whatever, and then in the next episode I'll show it off. So I'm going to end things off here, I guess. Uh, so I guess if you like this part, rate, comment, subscribe. Um, share this video. Do whatever the hell you want. This has been Dynamite Man, DGI. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, y'all.